Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Oklahoma liquor store just enraged every dem in town with warning sign to libs they put up. It's the end of the road for disrespectful people in this country who enjoyed eight years of protection under our previous apologetic president. To say anything to these those who wish to cause issues in society would result in being called a racist, or worse. Americans aren't being silent about this CR that has wreaked havoc in our communities and aren't accepting it or excuses for it any longer. As we all work together to make America great again with President Donald Trump leading the unapologetic way, citizens are taking their communities back, including one blunt liquor store owner who just royally enraged every liberal in town with a new sign that just went up in front of their store that doesn't care who is offended by it. Liberals, of course, are upset for this reason. People who act like thugs don't like being told what to do as they are used to getting their way and making others pay if they don't. An Oklahoma City liquor store doesn't care about offending them or being politically correct when it comes to what happens in and around his business he's worked hard to build. A trend that has gone on too long is on look that disrespectful to oneself and others is seen in the way some, barely, wear their pants that forces everyone to see their backsides and underwear. This isn't a fashion statement. It's an intrusive sight to see and disrespectful to everyone in public who they force it on. The sagging style also happens to be for a different reason, according to the liquor store, which is why they decided to impose a new rule and let everyone know about it with a warning to all who enter the store. Many who choose to sag their pants probably know it bothers people. Perhaps this is part of the reason they walk around with their pants practically around their ankles. While they can look sloppy and unable to dress themselves all they want, they can't do it at Midwest Wine and Spirits and think they are going to score some shot bottles. The store put up a new sign to stop the sagging on their property which said, Pull your pants up or don't come in. In big letters. In small writing beneath it, it adds, Try to have some decency and respect for others, no one wants to see your underwear. While employees of the store appreciate and support the sign, not everyone in town feels the same way. For reports, employees at the store said, Even though it may offend some people, the message is clear. It's tacky, and it's gross and we're adults. Pull up your pants, said employee Shauna Wiesner. Advertisement, story continues below. Wiesner also said it's a matter of security. Usually, when people come in with their pants sagging, it's easier for them to steal bottles, she said. People we spoke to had mixed reactions to the sign. I agree with it, said customer Chad Gilbert. I don't want to see anybody else's underwear. I realize wearing pants low is a fashion statement for some, but it doesn't work for me and I find it somewhat offensive. I can see that if it was like a church, said customer Sunshine Weatherby. There are families there, you might have a problem with that but this is a liquor store. I've seen worse at a liquor store. But, the store said, if you don't abide by the rules, you're welcome to leave. We don't need their business if they're not going to be by the rules. We got rules around here, people, Wiesner said. Gone are the days that people can perpetrate anything they want on other people in the name of political correctness. People's businesses and properties are their own and they can make the rules, knowing the risk of losing customers who they don't want there anyway. Chances are, Midwest Wine and Spirits will experience an increase in sales from paying customers who appreciate their stands. It used to be that anyone who disagreed with a person's rules or decisions could pitch a fit and make them pay. That's not how freedom works in America and President Trump has made that known. It's unacceptable for one person to use what they perceive as their rights to take another person's away. Perpetuating the entitled mentality that you can do whatever you want and other people have to deal with it, was one of the main causes of conflict, riots, and destructive issues in society that Barack Obama allowed. It's not racist to tell someone to pull up their pants in their business and if anyone thinks it is, that's their prerogative. It's just not going to work anymore in reversing anyone's rules. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.